Hi guys, I am so excited about today's video because today we are doing a spring break haul and if you can't tell, we are on location from spring break. Very exciting. Honestly, just excited to not be in my New York City studio apartment. I know that not everyone is able to travel this year, so spring break haul may not necessarily be applicable to everybody, but I have so many cute things from so many brands that I've never shopped before that I'm really excited about. I feel like there's a lot in this haul in terms of different price points that you guys will find that you'll be able to use just in the comfort of your own home. There's a lot of pieces, honestly, that I know I'm gonna be wearing again when I get back to New York just throughout the springtime just because all this stuff is really cute. Obviously, if you live in a warmer climate, you can enjoy this stuff all year round. I just had to do a haul because this is the first time in like years that I've actually had a quote unquote spring break. Although, full disclaimer, just wanna put it out there. The only reason I'm on this trip is because I am being compensated. I'm not, you know, trying to encourage or promote traveling just for the hell of it. Not quite yet. Let's wait until more people get vaccinated. Yeah, I am kind of on spring break and I can hear people outside of my hotel. Anyway, and I actually have stuff that I bought for the trip that I'm so excited about. I want to share it with you guys. We have a lot of cool new brands that I have never tried before and I'm really happy with everything. So let's just go ahead and get started. The first thing that I guess I can just get out of the way is I got three things from Revolve. First of all, I got these gold earrings from Love AJ. These are their famous baby Amalfi tube hoop. I have so many earrings from Love AJ, like almost all of these are, and I've tried so many over the years, but I've never tried these classic hoops, and I'm pretty sure that these are their like best seller, so I don't know why I've never tried them. I just wanted a hoop that was a little bit bigger. I just thought that that was like a little more vacation-y, so I have these in, and I really like them, and they're super lightweight, so highly recommend. Then I got two pairs of sandals. These are kind of basic and boring but I literally didn't have any rubber flip-flops the only like sandals that I have are the Takis which I think I've talked about on my channel before they are like a leather sandal I felt like I need something rubber just for like the pool or something so I just got a pair of Javianas plain black just they're slim very basic and I got them in a size 39.40 I'm a nine for reference they fit perfectly they're pretty inexpensive like 20 something dollars I just thought that these were a good staple to have these though I'm so excited about these. They are these sandals by Ray, and I believe they're called the Clive Sandal. They are a dupe for these sandals by The Row that were incredibly popular last summer. And actually, thank you, Lauren Elizabeth, for posting about these because I have kind of psychotically considered purchasing those sandals from The Row because I love them so much, but they're seven. I don't want to spend $700 on sandals, especially not white ones. Like I feel like they're going to get so dirty. But then Lauren posted about these this year. I was so excited. Ray tends to do a lot of shoes that are like not knockoffs of designers, but their version of designer shoes. So I highly recommend checking out Ray on Revolve. I don't know. I really like them. I feel like I can wear these with jeans in the spring as well. I think they look good with dresses, shorts, pants anything. They have like a squared kind of toe here. They're a little bit platformy. This part is very, very cushiony. And then the leather thong part is a little bit thicker. And I don't know. I just think it's very cool. Very modern looking. I don't, I, I just, I really like them. I also got these in a nine and they fit perfectly. Very true to size. Now let's move on to the actual like clothing items that I have. I knew that I was going to be lounging a lot on this trip, even though I am in the Bahamas by the way, I'm gonna be spending the majority of the trip in my room working, so I definitely wanted to be comfortable. I wanted a pair of like comfy lounge shorts and I've heard such good things about White Fox Boutique. So I finally got myself a pair of these mocha sweat shorts and they say White Fox right here in a really pretty cursive. You guys, these are so cute, so comfortable. The waistband is like very thick. I don't know if this is gonna be good or bad because I haven't worn them on this trip yet, but they're just a really nice material. Like they definitely feel more expensive than what I paid for them. I think they're around $30 and I used like Taylor King's discount code or something. So they were even cheaper than that. They're so, so nice and they're kind of high-waisted. They're just the right length, the perfect color. I'm, I'm so thrilled with these and I'm definitely gonna be purchasing more pairs of sweats and sweat shorts from White Fox for sure. Then to kind of like go with that, I really needed a new plain white tank. So I decided to hop on the trend and get the Lemity tank from Amazon. If you guys don't know, I think this is like a TikTok kind of trend, but this is the dupe 
for the Lululemon Align sports bra, sports tank, I think. It's a dupe for a Lululemon top. I can't really speak to whether or not it's a dupe for that because I don't have the Lululemon one, but it is very secure. It has like a built-in sports bra. It also has padding, but I took it out because as always happens with me, padding on any type of like sports bra, bra, or swimsuit ends up looking really stupid on me because the cup is smaller than my boob so it's like in the middle it just looks really bad so i took it out but um it's super comfortable i got it in a medium and i obviously just got plain white i really like it it's a nice thick material and yeah it's just exactly what i needed like a comfortable tank top that was a little bit more supportive than some of the like thinner ones that i wear just because i am on this trip with my family friends and we're close but we're not that close you know what i mean so this isn't like super see-through or anything i also feel like i'm probably gonna get that in a couple more colors because it's really nice. Then I made a Princess Polly order. I thought it was so funny. I was leaving my apartment to get into my Uber to like go to the airport. The mailman was coming as I was leaving and I was like, wait, do you have my Princess Polly package? And he was like, yes, I do. I'll just give it to you right now. So I literally opened this when I got here. I didn't even open it at home. Here's the thing. I'm gonna talk about this dress and tell you guys that it's absolutely amazing. It fits beautifully. However, I'm 99% sure I'm actually gonna exchange it for a different color because I'm kind of not wild about it. So it's this dress from Princess Polly, but it's from Lioness, if you guys don't know, is a brand that Princess Polly carries. It's a really nice light knitted material, a tank dress, like a midi length and then it has adjustable ties to make it like higher or lower and it's kind of ruched down the middle so it covers you really nicely. I think it fits great. I got it in a size four because everyone was saying to size down. I feel like traditionally I would get a six but I sized down to a four and it was perfect but the color is like not really doing it for me. If you can see I'm wearing this electric blue halter top from IMGia which I am obsessed with and this is more of the color that I was going for and this is just kind of like a muted blue it's not even like a bright baby blue. It's very muted and like more gray toned. It's, I don't, I feel like it's not even showing up true to color on camera. I don't know. We'll see. I haven't totally decided if I'm going to return it, but I might. But if anything, I would just get a different color. So I highly recommend the dress. I think it's great. And for the price, I was even thinking, oh, I can wear that out at night, like during the summer. Hopefully when we can start like actually going out, that would be great. With some cute little heels, like I'm so down for that. And then the other thing I got from Princess Polly is this skirt, which I'm definitely not returning. I love it. It's the asymmetrical skirt. If you guys saw my fall haul, I think it was, I got the asymmetrical jeans. This is the skirt version of the pants. I got it in a size eight because like I said, normally I'd be a six. I already knew from those previous jeans that I had to size up. I don't know, maybe it's because there's a button that goes across one side and then the other side, so it's a little tighter. The six were really uncomfortable for me in the jeans, so I sized up to the eight. So I knew this time to already size up to the eight and it was absolutely perfect. I just like the kind of waistline that this creates. It makes your waist look a little bit smaller and it's also a little bit longer because one of the sides comes down like this. So I really, really love it. And and I brought a lot of like really cute tops like this. So it's nice to just have some denim kind of thing. Can you see it? Can you picture it? Just throw on some sandals, get a cute little bag, put your sunglasses on and you're good to go. One moment, we need an iced coffee break. Um, the fact that that was literally in frame the entire time and I didn't even realize because the sun is in my eyes so much that I literally cannot see anything. I'm sorry. So just ignore my iced coffee and my liquid IV. That yes, I brought liquid IV on this trip with me because I cannot go a day without drinking liquid IV. Link down below. Okay, so let's finish off the haul with the swimwear that I got. I honestly have not purchased new swimwear in four, maybe five years. All of the swimsuits that I had were just no longer really in style or didn't fit, honestly. I did actually repurchase a swimsuit that I do already own, but Savannah, if you're watching this, I'm pretty sure I left it at your house in Charleston when I came to visit you a couple of years ago. But it's this amazing one piece from Gooseberry. I decided to just repurchase it because I know it's a great one piece. I did size up though because I used to have the medium and honestly, every time I would bend over my nipples would just absolutely come out. So I decided to size up to a large and I'm so happy that I did. And I also got it in a different color. Last time I had it in black, this time I got the kind of like cocoa brown color because apparently I'm someone that wears brown now. I love that they come in this little like waterproof zippered bag. This is so amazing to have. Shouts to them for that. Also, I used a coupon code from Gooseberry that I've literally had for like three years and it still works. I'll leave a link down below for you guys 
guys because I do have a discount. I have a discount for a lot of this stuff, by the way. White Fox, I think I have a code. Goose Bear, I have a code. Maybe one other. So be sure to check the description box, obviously for all the links, but also for a discount. This is the suit and I love it. It's amazing. It's just this very deep V one piece in this amazing brownish, taupish, purplish, grayish kind of color. It's fantastic. It looks so good on. It's very flattering in this fabric right here really really like hugs and sucks you in it's high cut on the side i feel like it's a decent amount of coverage on the back i wanted to have a swimsuit option like this just because like i said i'm here with family friends and even though i'm not really gonna be going to the beach and in the pool like i'm mostly gonna be here working i know that if there is a time i do go and hang out with them i would like to be a little bit more covered up and i really like doing this kind of tone on tone look at the brown white fox shorts with the brown gooseberry swimsuit. Like, hello, that's so cute. Super, super flattering. I'm obsessed with this. I love it. I love that it comes with a little bag. For a one piece, it was fairly inexpensive. I wanna say around like $80 with my discount. And they have other colors as well. So totally recommend checking that out. Then I got a swimsuit from the brand Same Los Angeles. Again, something that Lauren Elizabeth posted about and I looked into myself. I love how this looks on you guys. The reason that I pulled the trigger on this one is because it came with a matching sarong. And again, I like to be a little bit more covered up down there. This is like my insecure area. I'm not insecure at all about the upper half, but the lower half of my body, I am more insecure about. So I definitely like to have a little bit more coverage, especially again, like I said, being with people that I feel like I'm related to. It is hard to find suits that come with a matching sarong where it kind of looks like a whole outfit but it's still like young and hot looking so i feel like this is a good balance between like being covered up but also feeling super cute and it's in this zebra material which isn't like a black and white zebra it's more of a cream and dark 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 brown zebra we have these high-waisted bottoms which actually have a tiny bit of a v there at the top which i think is very flattering the coverage on these on the back is not great for me like it's definitely very cheeky but you have the sarong so it's fine and i feel like this is just a great thing to have because then i can wear this one suit like if i go to the beach with friends or something that would totally be fine but wear with the sarong when i'm in mixed company so you have that bottom and then the top the top i'm so excited for this top i absolutely adore it it is this bra style top that has these bows on your shoulders you guys this is freaking adorable it has like an underwire kind of supportive cup here these ties are obviously adjustable and then it clips in the back just like a bra would i got this in a medium and i'm a 34d and it fits perfectly no problems like i don't know if it's something about the bows but it makes me feel adorable and this on its own is super cute but then it comes with a matching sarong and i need to be really upfront with you guys i actually i made some alterations to this sarong actually i didn't michelle did if you guys watch the vlogs you know michelle i'll insert a picture of what it looks like on the website of the girl wearing this swimsuit with the sarong i have no idea how that is expected to fit on any person because when i opened this package you guys i was like shook in not a good way this is the sarong this is it like it does advertise on the website that you could also wear it as like a top or in your hair on your head, but it is also meant to be a sarong. Whose butt does this cover? Because it does not cover mine. But like I said, it's so hard to find a swim option that has the matching sarong fabric. So what I had Michelle do was go through with a seam ripper and open it up. Instead, you have double the fabric. And this, this is a sarong now. Sorry if anyone from same is watching this video. I kind of Frankensteined your sarong, but it's perfect for me now. It still has the seam from the top, but it's not visible when you're wearing it. And it's very comfortable. It looks so cute all together. And I just feel like this is a very elevated looking swim option. I don't know why. It's just a little bit more designed. So it looks a little bit more elevated. And like I said, the muted zebra, instead of just being black and white, I think makes it look like a little bit more, you know, I'm going on the boat today, like that kind of thing. I love having that option. Then I got another option that has a sarong because I just feel like I don't really feel comfortable wearing just a bikini, but I like to have like kind of an outfit with it and then I feel comfortable. So I tried something from Heart of Sun and you guys, it comes in this cute little plastic bag, which is also, again, great that you can just either use for your swimsuit or use for something else. Like, I love this. You can see it's this blue color that I obviously love. It was very 
very high-waisted little bottoms here that tie on the side. Then you have this top, which apparently can be worn so many different ways. It's just your standard kind of bikini top. However, it comes with this card where they show you all of the different ways that you can style the top. I will try one of these in the try-on portion to show you guys. I got both of those in a large and definitely could not have gone any smaller. <laughs> And then, this is so cute, I love this. I also got the matching sarong, which is just like a sheer blue that matches, obviously, and it has this little plastic buckle here so you can adjust how big the sarong is. Basic, perfect, looks good. Then, this though is what really excited me because I just feel like I've never really seen anything like this. It's a sheer crop top, which to me is very 70s inspired because it has like bell sleeves. It ties in the front with that same kind of plastic buckle that matches on the skirt, it has these bell sleeves. I just like love this. And also could totally see myself wearing this just like on a night out in the spring with some jeans. So I love that you get like another shirt out of it, but it looks perfect with the swimsuit. And it looks perfect if you wear like just the bikini and the sarong, or if you wear obviously just the bikini, or if you wear all four pieces together, they all look really good. I'm so happy about that. And I got the sarong in a large, but I got the top in a medium, so. Oh my God, this is the last thing. Okay, like I said, I was hunting for sarongs. I was hunting for like cover-ups and just things that I could wear with bikinis so that I would feel like a little bit more comfortable. I have a purple bikini from Lolly and Layla. And I thought to myself, like, I wish I could bring that swimsuit because I did get it within the last year. And so I know it fits, but it's so like exposed. And I really wasn't liking any of the cover-ups that I was finding but I looked for sarongs on Amazon and these were super highly rated and they had so many different fun colors and patterns. I took a leap and decided to get this pattern, hoping that it would look good with the purple. And I really think it does. Let me know in the comments if you agree, but I think I did a pretty good job. So it's this purplish pinkish leopard print and it kind of has a little bit of a gradient. But honestly guys, this sarong was like, I wanna say $9 and just the amount of fabric that you get, the cut is absolutely perfect. Like this is, this is just great. I think everyone should own one of these sarongs in any color, it doesn't matter. It's just, I, I think it's absolutely perfect. And I think it looks really cute with the lavender suit, the neon pink nails, you know, I'm, I'm really into it. If I would have had to go on like a longer trip where I would have needed like more bikinis, I would have definitely gotten one of these in another color to match with something else, just because they're so inexpensive and just as good quality as like this is, but for a very small fraction of the price. All right, well that's everything for this haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I hope that you found something that you might want to try for this spring and summertime. I hope that everyone is having a great spring break. Please subscribe if you are not already. If I didn't mention this before, I'm 28 years old. I live in New York City. I do primarily fashion and lifestyle content, four to five videos a month. I would love to have you. So stick around if any of that interests you. Click the bell to be notified anytime that I upload. All of my links are in the description box including my Instagram, which is where I am the most active, my Twitter, TikTok, SoundCloud, if you wanna to listen to any of my DJ mixes and Spotify, things like that. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget, all of the links are in the description and I will also be putting all of the discounts. Leave a comment and let me know if you guys end up purchasing anything and if you like it, that's it for me. I'm gonna go back to work now but with this amazing sunny view. So like, no complaints. <laughs> Bye kisses. Yeah.